Hello everyone, welcome to the FT Share channel, and today we're featuring an engine commonly known as the Boxer engine. Often considered the heart or core of a vehicle, the engine configuration significantly contributes to an engine's characteristics. For example, the widely known four-cylinder inline engine is renowned for its fuel consumption, production, and maintenance efficiency. On the other hand, for higher performance, we often look to V-configured engines known for their more aggressive characteristics. But here, we will discuss the reciprocating engine with the best engine balance ever produced, the Boxer engine. This engine got its name due to its unique configuration, where the pistons are positioned horizontally on both sides of the crankshaft. This piston configuration has popularized the term Boxer engine. The Boxer engine concept was first patented by Carl Friedrich Benz under the name Contra Engine in 1896, 18 years after he created the world's first internal combustion engine with a successful single-cylinder configuration, which is still widely used today. The Boxer engine is designed with oppositely positioned pistons, aiming for each piston to counterbalance the vibration of the other, resulting in excellent engine balance. Unlike a flat engine where each crank pin must support two pistons simultaneously, each crank pin is responsible for just one piston in a Boxer engine. However, the engine must have at least two pistons set at a 180 degree angle, causing the engine block to protrude sideways. This design allows the pistons and engine to move horizontally, similar to the straight jab of a boxer. The firing order for the boxer engine is 1, 3, 2, 4. This sequence differs from most inline engines, which typically follow a 1, 3, 4, 2 firing order, giving the boxer engine a distinctive sound. Furthermore, if we examine the pistons of the Boxer engine, we find they aren't precisely parallel. This causes tremendous momentum at both ends of the crankshaft, but this can be managed by strengthening each end of the crankshaft, adding counterweights or increasing the number of cylinders to 6 with a 60 degrees firing order gap or to 8 cylinders with a 45 degree gap. These engines have proven their advantages in various applications. For example, Subaru's four-cylinder engine has shown its prowess in rally racing, Porsche with its six-cylinder engines, and the BMW R 1200 GS motorcycle with its two-cylinder engine. Now let's discuss the advantages and disadvantages of the Boxer engine. Firstly, the low and flat position of the engine gives it a low center of gravity. The engine's wider shape distributes pressure evenly across the chassis, providing excellent stability at high speeds and challenging terrains. Additionally, the flat and compact design typically fills the lower part of the engine bay, creating more space at the top. This offers the advantage of a larger, better positioned air intake area, resulting in lower temperatures. Furthermore, due to its wider and shorter dimensions within the engine bay, the position of the boxer engine in a car is often swapped with the rear trunk, leading to larger front storage space. Now, let's discuss its disadvantages. One of the main drawbacks is the engine's more complex components, with two cylinder heads on the left and right sides. This design requires more components, including two timing chains, camshafts, gears, and cylinder blocks. This complexity leads to higher assembly costs due to the longer and more involved assembly process and the use of more spare parts. Additionally, the engine's position under the car makes maintenance more challenging. Okay, that's all the information we can provide in this video. What do you think about this engine? We're eager to hear your thoughts in the comment section below. 